Hey guys, you are most welcome again on my YouTube channel. I did, I didn't get much time today, so let's start today's uh, video with some MCQs related to T. S. Eliot. Hope you gonna find uh, it useful. And if you don't know about uh, you know T. S. Eliot much and Wasteland and his uh, works like Prefrog and other observations and uh, the divisions and quotations you can check out the videos related to T.S. Eliot. There are six videos related to T.S. Eliot Okay, modern period. So if you Really want to practice well T.S. Eliot you should go through those notes and then you should come to this video But let's go ahead. Let's see to whom did T.S. Eliot dedicated his wasteland Your answer is a you can pause the video and you can see the things and you can read the uh, all the options to whom did T.S. Eliot dedicated uh, dedicate his prefrog and other observations W.B. Eats, Ezra Pound, Gene Warden, F.R. Lewis your answer is C. Gene Warden and uh, Gene Warden he, he was T.S. Eliot's friend who, who was killed in World War I so you can remember this name Jane Wardenel. He was T. S. Eliot's, uh, you know, friend. Into how many parts the wasteland divided? Two parts, three part, four parts, or five parts? Let me put a mark. Five parts. In which words the T is T. S. Eliot's the wasteland written? Free verse, blank verse, sprung rhythm, or prose verse? Answer is free verse. Which of the following poems ends with Datta, Dayadhavanam, Damiyata, Shanti, Shanti, Shanti? We all know that the answer is the wasteland. T.S. Eliot, the sacred wood is a collection of poems. Poetical play, a collection of critical article, and a classical drama. Answer is C. A collection of critical articles. What is T. S. Eliot's The Cocktail Party? Collection of essays, drama, poems, or work? Critical work. It is a drama. T.S. Eliot's line, Sweet themes run softly till I end my song, is quoted from a poem by Shakespeare, Dunn, Wordsworth, or Spencer. Answer is T. The phrase dissociation of sensibility was used by Eliot in traditional and individual talent. The metaphysical poets Dante or Baudelaire. Answer is the metaphysical poets. T. S. Eliot uses the term objective correlative in the function of criticism, tradition or individual talent, the frontier of criticism, Hamlet and his problem. Answer is D. And we all know that in this work, he said that it was a failed work just because of it does not follow objective correlative concept on what basis does Eliot call Hamlet an artistic failure you can see because Hamlet broods too much because Hamlet feigns madness because the plot of Hamlet is disjoined because Hamlet lacks the objective correlative answer is D T.S. Eliot has not written a critical article on one of the following locate him. Blake, Dante, Swinburne or Shelley? Answer is Shelley. Which play of Shakespeare has been regarded as one of Shakespeare's most assured artistic success by T.S. Eliot? Coriolanus, Hamlet, The Tempest, The Comedy of Error. Answer is A. Coriolanus. 
What is according to T.S. Eliot the most powerful tool in the hands of critic? Evaluation of central thought of the work under review, comparison and analysis, language and style of the author under review, evaluation of the structural unit of the work under review. Answer is B. Comparison and analysis. T.S. Eliot calls Arnold a propagandist of literature and an overworked school inspector. Where does he make this observation? In the perfect critic, in imperfect critic, in a romantic aristocrat, in the local flavor. Answer is A. T.S. Eliot calls one of the following plays of Shakespeare the most wonderful Shakespeare's plays. Which of the following it is? Cymbeline, The Tempest, Antony and Cleopatra, Romeo and Juliet. Answer is C. Antony and Cleopatra. T.S. Eliot calls Byron so empty of matter, Shelley so in incoherent, and Wordsworth so wanting in completeness and variety. Where does he say so? In the preface of the sacred word, in the introduction to the sacred word, in tradition and individual talent, and in perfect critic. Answer is B. In the introduction of the sacred word. T.S. Eliot says, No poet, no artist of any art has his complete meaning alone. Why? Now let me tell you the direct answer you can pause video answer is C because he is connected with tradition uh, if you don't know what tradition and individual talent the work tells you can check out my video I have already made a video T.S. Eliot says poetry is not turning loose of emotion but an escape from emotion it is not the expression of personality but an escape from personality answer is C in tradition and individual talent he quoted this I have measured out my life with coffee spoon from which poem of Eliot in this is this line quoted C Sweeney erect no I am not Prince Hamlet nor was mean to be from which poem Eliot is this line quoted Gerentine. When lovely woman stoops to follow and paces about her room again, alone, she smooths her hair and with automatic hand and puts a record on gramophone. From which poem of Eliot are these lines quoted? The first sermon. I hope you enjoyed the video. It really you really enjoyed please share comment and give a thumbs up see you tomorrow bye bye take care good luck for exams